I was so excited when this wine came in, and it, to explain why, um, you have to be a door, <laughs> like me in the wine business. You know, the thing is, is that, you know, I love exploring, you know, when I'm in Bordeaux or Burgundy or, or anywhere, you know, it's like, well, what is that? Who is that? What, what, are, what, what are these guys, you know? And in Pouillac, as you know, uh, it's not a huge commune. I mean, it's a good size, but it's, you know, it's not a huge uh, commune. Uh, and as you well know, Pouillac is home to basically most of the first growths, uh, most of the second growths, <laughs> and, uh, and so on and so forth. And basically, it's just a plethora of 100-point wines. And essentially, uh, there are some properties that have been in families for many generations. And one of the families, uh, the Raynaud family, uh, has owned their property for seven generations. So you can only imagine what this property is now worth. It's 17 acres, and essentially it sits between Lynch Bosch and uh, Pouillac, um, uh, Pichon Lalande, Pichon Comtesse, and it sits at the highest basically the highest elevation of Pouillac, and that kind of equals to Mouton Rothschild. Okay, so here you have, you have 17 acres of prime land, and I mean prime land. So this family, you know, I mean, I'm sure everybody is knocking on their door wanting to buy this piece of property. I'm sure it's all you know, the Pichons and the Latours, and I mean, just because it's, killer dirt. So anyway, going back to the wine. Chateau O de la Bacade, okay? And I've been following this property, but the problem was I can never get it because it sells out instantly when it's produced. It's like the best secret, like those in the know in Bordeaux, in France, in Belgium, and most of Europe. So this wine rarely comes to the States. Uh, in fact, there's only a couple people selling this wine in, here in the United States, and with the best price being $60, okay? So follow, follow me now. So here this property is in the land of giants, right? 70% Cabernet Sauvignon, 25% Merlot, 5% Cabernet Franc. Um, from the 2009 vintage. So this was this is a re-release that came out and Negotiant had it on their list. As soon as I saw it, I'm like, I want it, okay? The wine came in, I let it sit for like a couple weeks. It was so hard for me not to open a bottle. And finally I did. And cameraman and myself and answer man are enjoying it right now. <laughs> and I'm telling you, it's so Pouillac. It's, it, I wish I had like a bottle of like Lynch sitting next to it or maybe a Pichon Baron just to compare the two. Because you're talking, these wines are now selling for like 250, 260 a bottle, right? 29.98. It's crazy good wine for the money. And the thing is, no one really knows about it. The press doesn't, they don't, they don't send it out to the press. So it's like I said, it's like a little secret. I only got 25 cases of this wine. I bought everything I can get my paws on. And I'm telling you right now, if there's ever a great deal in Bordeaux, this is it. It's like drinking Lynch Bosch from the 09 Vintage or Pichon Baron. I mean, they're not the same, but if you know what I'm saying, it's already getting those secondary flavors going on right now. Just absolutely glorious wine. And again, at 29.98, crazy. New French oak, 18 months, all hand, hand harvest. Again, it's small. You know, production's probably maybe less than a thousand cases. And like I said, it, it all goes to the, Euro, the European market. So anyway, get your hands on this wine. It's going to sell out fast. It's so good. I'm taking a case for myself. Sorry. <laughs>